Hey, good afternoon, everyone. So, this is a new video from, as you can see, villain of the story, the Metal Titans from Minnesota. Uh, shout out to Christian Gray. He watched the first reaction video and he thought it was cool, so I salute you, sir. Let's get started. Mmm, interesting. Fuck oh, yeah. It's gotta go louder. Yup, goosebumps. So it's interesting. I'm definitely getting a little bit of different vibes from different genres here. Like, it's definitely heavy AF, so we're getting deathcore, a little bit of hardcore influences, metalcore for sure. But with that symphonic in the background, they're blending a little bit of what I would say is, you know, black metal elements. So it's interesting that they're searching from all different genres to make this song. I like it. So that chanting is giving off a Born of Osiris vibe, but what I really like about this track is it's got that slow and low groove that you would hear in like the early 2000s metal. You know, in my opinion, the best time for metal. These guys are definitely on point with what they're doing. I'm very excited to see them grow as a band and get more popular. So this is interesting. So like, I've played guitar for the past 15 years, and I've really noticed that this band is all about dynamics. It's not just heavy, it's not just brutal, it's not just ambient and melodic. They do a lot of mixing of their dynamics and their songs, and that's one of the reasons why this band really stands out to me, is that it has a little bit of everything in it for all your different kind of metal fans and their subgenres. Cleans are a nice touch. I'm usually not into clean sections or clean vocals, but these guys do it well. It's not overdone, and it's put in right positions. I feel the
we'll just kind of let that one fade out. So that ending section really blew me away. I wasn't expecting them to tune down the tempo like that, but it worked really well because you had, I assume he's the backup singer or one of the other main singers. I think he also plays guitar, but he's singing cleans, and then you can slightly hear Christian in the background doing his unclean guttural style vocals, and that really mixes well together because, yes, you're getting more ambient clean sounds from the guitars and the drums. It's not as aggressive and not as fast-paced, but when you have, in my opinion, you know, Christian's background screams, there's still some intensity within a more mellow moment. And like I said, dynamics. This band is all about dynamics and making your ears happy. So if you guys haven't checked out Villain of the Story or given them a like on Facebook, I would strongly suggest that you go over there and you show them some love. You know, these guys have been at this for quite a few years now, even though they're relatively young dudes, but they are hungry. You know, they, in my opinion, are ready to go out there and start playing some main stages, opening for some bigger bands. I would love to see these guys tour with Whitechapel, Veil vale Amaya, or, you know, Born of Osiris. You know, the gent bands, these guys would fit very well in with the gent bands. You know, they would also fit well with the Death Accord guys as well. Um, Job for Cowboys coming out with a new album. It would be great to see these guys on that tour. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I hope you're having a great day or night, wherever you're at. And as always, keep it metal.